of his family and he loved God as the number one leader in his life. That is the mother of an eight-year-old boy who lost his life to gun violence last night. Family tells Fox 5 Peyton Evans just finished a football scrimmage and was playing video games inside a Maryland apartment when he was shot dead. And police say he was not the intended target. Sierra Fox on the story tonight. She is live in Landover after speaking with the family. Sierra. Jim and Marina, this is where eight-year-old Peyton Evans, lovingly known as PJ, was shot and killed. You can see the door is now boarded up and there's shattered glass everywhere on the ground. Police say they are still looking for the person who committed this senseless act. And when I spoke with PJ's mother today, she had tears in her eyes and this message for the killer. It was some coward mess that you did, but you're going to pay for it. You're going to pay for it. You hear me? You are going to pay for it. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm a believer of the Lord, man. God is my number one provider. And I put that in my son. He knew that God was his provider. Turn yourself in. Be a man. Be a respectable human being. If you ever were not one before, now is the time for you to turn yourself in. The Prince George's County Police Chief says around 8.20 last night, a white sedan pulled into the Lansdowne Village Apartments on Bright Seat Road and fired multiple rounds. He says eight-year-old Peyton was not the intended target. PJ's mom says he just finished football practice and went to a family member's house for Taco Tuesday. He started playing video games, and 10 minutes later, he died in her arms. A neighbor tells us this has never happened in her 14 years of living in her apartment, but now she wants to move. Portia Lee heard the commotion. It was pop, 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 and then pop, pop, pop. It was more like a boom, 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 then boom, boom, boom. It was really loud. It's just tragic. I mean, it, it was a, it was a, it's a baby, basically. Eight years old, I mean, he, he's a baby. And why would you just shoot into an apartment like that. And then not just that apartment, but then the next door neighbor's apartment too. Like, what are you doing? Here's Peyton's mom, Tiffany Evans, sharing with Fox 5 that he was about to start the third grade at Thomas G. Pool and School, a creative and performing arts academy where he was on the honor roll. He loved to sing and dance, and he was also an athlete, a football player. Right now, PJ's family is planning for his funeral as well as a community visual. When we learn more about it, we'll be sure to let you know on fox5dc.com. And in the meantime, his mother just appreciates everyone's support and love during this difficult time. Back to you. Well,